4,300 attacks. That's how many the Israeli military said its aircraft and ground troops have carried out in the Gaza Strip since the war began five weeks ago. The U.S. is still pushing for temporary pauses that would allow for wider distribution of badly needed aid. But Israel has only agreed to brief daily periods to allow civilians to flee ground combat in northern Gaza and head south on foot. Back here at home, leaders in our nation's capital are preparing for a pro-Israel rally on the National, National Mall. Tens of thousands of people are expected to gather tomorrow night right in front of the U.S. Capitol. The March for Israel is organized by the Jewish Federations of North America. They say it's about Americans coming together in solidarity with the people of Israel. They're expecting anywhere between 40 and 60,000 people to